Hey guys, if you want to help the channel out, the affiliate links will be down in the description for Redoto Power, Power Queen, Slops Audio, Sir Juan Vega, and Big Jeff Audio. Go down in the description and you can go look at the code uh, for 5% off on your order. Alright, back to the video. Hey guys, welcome to or welcome back to my channel. In today's video, yes, you read the title. I am going to be reviewing the Slaps Audio Oblivion 15. This is the dual, uh, this is the D4 version. So it is the forum version. So I made a previous video on Slaps Audio. Here you go. I'll pop it up on the screen. You can go check that out. They're, they're a newer company and, um, they're very, very budget friendly. And I'll gave Slaps Audio a uh, message and they came back to me and they were like hey we'll give we'll uh, send you an oblivion uh, to review and um, I was like all right bet so basically this is gonna be the oblivion 15 uh, this is gonna be the forum version I'm gonna be hooking up to the prefab 15 box right there I know it's gonna be a little bit small for this sub but that's all I have so far or right now um, slaps audio this thing's gonna be a four inch uh, black coated aluminum coil guys it's going to be 2000 watts rms 4000 watt peak and it is going to be two spiders so it is double spidered so let's get this thing out of the box and actually take a look at it all right guys here's what it looks like standard packaging um it says the oblivion 15 d4 on it slaps let's get this thing out Guys, they also come with a sticker. I may be using this sticker. I love my stickers. So uh, let's put the phone back in and take a look at this thing. Oh yeah, look at this thing. This is the Slaps 15 Oblivion. This thing is absolutely ginormous. It's a monster. There's the four inch voice coil. It goes into the motor. That thing is huge. As you can see, it is ginormous and uh here's the double spider so we have one one pack right there the other pack right here and i can feel it when i push it down i can feel them together rub together so that means that there is it is double uh spidered and we also guys this is what i like to see it is screwed down i love to see that spiders are screwed down guys that's a big issue in the um the subwoofer community or uh, people who make subwoofers, they don't, they, they only glue it down. You gotta glue it and screw it for the best um, spider. All right, let's see how many tinsel leads we got. So we, it looks like we have two flat tinsel leads going to each coil on both sides. I love to see that. This is a 2000 RMS uh, rated subwoofer. So you're gonna need those tinsel leads. All right, let's check out the terminals right here. So this is gonna be, this terminal is a little bit crooked, but here it is. This terminal is gonna be, these are gonna be six gauge terminals, guys. I did test it. It is not a four gauge, it is going to be six gauge. Um, I'm not too sure on the magnet size. I'll pop it up on the screen if it's on the website. And yeah, that's the, the, the motor size. Plenty of cooling for the voice coil so much air that can go out and we also have um right here we also have some venting which is super nice to see this thing is stiff as could be so i gotta break this in the dust cap so i like the slaps dust cap it's going to be actually it's going to be a very strong i'm pretty sure it's going to be a very strong paper uh dust cap um, we have a stitch surround, white stitch surround. Now we do not have the biggest foam surround, which is all right. It's just a standard looking foam surround. The basket is giant. It's an aluminum basket. And um, yeah, this thing looks great. Now I did hook it up to the car before making this and um, just to try and break it in a little bit, but dude, this thing, has to break in so much so I, I just need to get it out of the car and do a little bit of a review on it so what i'm the plan for this video is i'm gonna slap this in the box and i'm gonna do a couple frequencies i'm gonna do a couple uh, music and possibly an rms test um depending on 
how strong my amp is uh, because guys I am going to be reviewing a March Digital 8K and for that to happen I have to get my new alternator in um, that will be coming in shortly so I may just wait for the 8K to test this RMS uh, rating because this is a D4 and I have to hook it down to um, 2 ohms um, but that's all right. But the ohms do rise in the car. I just can't get over this coil, guys. This thing is huge. It is a four inch black aluminum coil. When I was breaking it in, it the coil did smell. It did smell like a, um, it kind of smelled like the material used in the Defbonce coils because those, those coils have a very distinct smell and that's what i smelled off of this thing it wasn't it's not like it was like stinking up the car it's just a break-in smell but still like if it's the same material as the def bonds this is a 2.75 inch coil guys this thing can handle 1500 watts no problem if that's true this thing can handle 2k without any issues especially if it's a four inch coil so I'll pop up the price on this thing. This thing is super affordable, guys. I don't think you understand this. So on the screen right now, this is the Slaps Audio website, and you can actually purchase one of these for 240 bucks, which is crazy to me. Um, this is the cheapest subwoofer for what it is that I've ever seen. I have a link in the description. I uh, contacted Slaps and I was like, hey, do you want? Uh, do you think you can make me a discount code for my viewers? Because I know y'all like your discount codes. So in the description, if you go to the Slaps uh, in the description and use code Base Menace, you can get 5% off of your order. That's already cheap as fuck. I just can't get over that. The price of this sub and the, the quality of this thing, unreal. So this is the Slaps Audio. This is the Hyanka 15. Look at the height difference. Look how much beefier that the Slaps is compared to the Hyanka. It's crazy. Uh, but anyway, guys, enough of me chatting. Um, let's, let's get this thing in a box and see what it can do. All right, guys, got the Slaps Audio Oblivion 15 uh, D4 breaking in right now. It's gonna be a couple hours, so might as well get this done. I'll get back to you when it's uh, when it's done breaking. In. All right, guys, got the Slaps Audio Oblivion 15 hooked up to the car. Got my SMD right there. I'm gonna turn that on, and it is on a 5,000 watt amp. I'll do an RMS test uh, at a later date, so when I get my 8K in, I can actually push this thing to 2K RMS. Um, but right now we're just going to do some frequency tests and then music tests and then that'll be it for this video just to see how it sounds. All right guys, 30 hertz. Let's get into it. All right, let's see what we got. So we rose up to 3.2 ohms, 1477. Let's do 35 hertz. All right guys, 35 hertz. Let's get it. So we rose up to 3.3, 14.58. Let's do 40 hertz. All right, guys, 40 hertz. Let's get it. All right, we rose up to 4 ohms, 15.04. All right, let's get 45 hertz and then get to music. All right, guys, 40 hertz, 45 hertz. Let's see what we got. So this time we, we rose up the 4.8 and only a 10, uh, 1,048 watts. So guys, this will obviously be a lot better on an 8K. Since it is a 4 ohm sub, I could I hooked it down to 2 ohm, but it keeps on rising up in ohms. Um, if I got a 2 ohm sub, I could wire it down to 1 ohm and it would rise up to about 2 or 3 ohms, so I would get a better score. But let's just get into music and see how it sounds. Yes, yes. 
All right, guys, that was a little bit of a frequency and music demo of the Slaps Oblivion 15. This thing did really hit those lows and the, and actually the 40s really well. Um, they, it, obviously, they would do a lot better in a different box. This is just a prefab box. If you had a custom box uh, for specifically for this sub, it will get a lot louder. Um, yeah, I did not smell it at all. Let's see if it's warm. It's a little warm, but that's all right. I mean, I can't even smell it though. Um, it got, I think the max I saw was like 2000 something on one of the dinos. Uh, but yeah, dude, this thing, this thing slaps, no pun intended, for 240 bucks. You can't get much better than this. All right, guys, if you like this video, like, comment, subscribe. And if you want to purchase one of these, uh, go down in my uh, in the links in the description, my affiliate link. Use code BASEMENT as for 5% off your order. That's already cheap. Um, the 240 bucks. I mean, and 5% off, that's crazy. Um, but yeah, guys, if you like this video, like, comment, subscribe, and I'll see you in the next one. Peace.